hey y'all, you're in the kitchen with Tanya and it's snack time. You know, a lot of people think that raw food has to be hard. It has to be, I don't know, just elaborate and, you know, I used to try to make all these raw concoctions and what you do at first is you, you try to make things into like mock meat or I don't know, like you try to make it into the things you used to eat, like raw macaroni and cheese or raw mashed potatoes. I just don't even do it. I just eat the raw food. And now I don't even want something that looks like, I don't know, hamburger meat. I just, I don't need it. I just need raw plants. So it's snack time and we're just going to do a simple snack, okay? We're going to call this, um, I don't know. Let's call it pepper boats, okay? So, here's what we have. I've chopped up all these little peppers, red and yellow and green. I have a, about two tablespoons of lemon juice on there, and I have some lemon pepper, Mrs. Dash, and I do have a, a little sprinkle of dehydrated onions on there, okay? So, and they were the little peppers like this. So, oh. And you can't forget a little orange. Okay, so I have that. What I have right here is chopped up. It's the dulse. I keep on showing y'all this seaweed because this is so mineral rich. And I've noticed when, if I quit eating this for a, an amount of time, I, I start to feel weird. I don't feel myself. I don't feel as energetic. I think it's the minerals that are missing sometimes. So this is great for this. Um comes in these little packages. I keep on showing y'all this because I want you to get it. So, then I have my romaine, they're little boats. See, I just open them up like that. And what we're going to do is we're going to take the, the dulse and I've just cut them in strips. And I'm just going to lay them down in my boat. Plus, it has a little salty flavor and I, I really think it's a one of the keys to staying on low-fat raw vegan is to have something salty like that if you want or have something sweet. So then what I'm going to do is I'm going to just, I'm very messy today, I'm going to just layer on my peppers, okay, like that, so you have a big boat. And then what I'm going to use for like a little dressing on there, I have this already made up. I don't have much of it left, but what this is is my mangoes were getting really ripe and I needed to use them or do something with them. So what I did is I peeled them, took out the seed, I put them in the Vitamix with some water and a little lemon juice to preserve them, and I blended it up into just, you know, like a dressing consistency. So it's really just mangoes. It's so good. So what I would do is I would just put a little bit on there. See, see how good that is? These are so delicious. I mean, I don't know. It's a great snack, but also, you know, we talked about being prepared, too, last time I talked to you, and see, this is what I do. When I make up, like, my hot raw tomato soup, I make extra. I make twice as much, and then I will store it. I can use that for dressing, or if I want it hot again, I'll just throw it back in the Vitamix and blend it up till it's a little bit warm. Here's my spicy mango dressing I made the other day, and I have some more. So I always have things like this on hand. That way, if I have a salad, that's the big problem is the dressing. So you have to have these things. All these are on my YouTube. Um, the recipes are there. But anyway, so you have your little mango boat. Y'all have a good day. Bye.